Hello, my name is Olivier and this is your Wine Rendezvous. Today, we have a little situation for you. We're at a restaurant, okay, and you have to pick the wine. You really don't know how to act with your, with your girlfriend, with your boss. It's pretty intimidating. You really don't know what to do. So I'm going to give you a little toolbox, a few uh, handy little pieces of advice, and you're going to be just fine. Ali, let's do it. Action. La, 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 la. Monsieur. Oh. Monsieur. Okay, freeze. Here, first thing, the wine list. Okay, so it's very complex. You really don't know what to do. You afraid of making a mistake with your girlfriend? You don't know what to do. So of course, if you want to have a little class, you go for French wine. Okay, um, you want a white wine, fruity, fresh, Sancerre. You want more creamy, buttery. Uh, Burgundy, okay, boom. In those two cases, you're super safe. In the red wines, little tip, uh, I like you, so I'll give you a little tip up out of my personal uh, experience. If you want like a big, strong, powerful, masculine red, go for the ones from the south of France, which are very good value, uh, up and coming, uh, and not too expensive, okay? So really nice discoveries to do in the Languedoc region of France, for instance. Uh, go for, look for Corbière, for Minervois, you'll find great value wine, uh, really nice. And you can uh, come up with that little blurb I just gave you and you'll, you'll look very impressive. So, voilà, allez. Uh, Corbière, s'il vous plaît. Merci, monsieur. Merci. So while you order, then you can, okay, you can relax, okay? You did the, the hardest part, so you can chill. Um, voilà. Who's gonna come and uh, let's make it happen? Little conversation. Oh, merci, monsieur. So here it just presents you the, the the label just to check if it's actually the same thing as the one you ordered. Here, no problem. Let's keep going. Merci, monsieur. Voila. How are you, honey? Good. Yeah. We shall send the contract now. Later. Okay. Let's do it. Um, well, just relax. Huh? No problem. Oh, merci. Now, uh, this is a very, very American thing to do. In the US, they hand you the cork like this. Oh, you might want to smell the cork to see if there's a problem. If potentially you'll have a corked wine. Uh, usually, it's just a tiny little spot on your cork that is actually going to be uh, smelling a bit weird. So either you spend like two hours smelling around and obviously if you're looking for a contract for a job or for a date or more, it's lost from this beginning, so I recommend you just go the French way and just forget about it. Okay, merci, monsieur. So voila, you can keep going, keep talking, and your waiter will come back. Oh, here he is. Merci. Merci. So here, the idea is that it just serves you just a little bit of wine, just to check if there's a problem with the wine. Oh, don't go like... Oh no, raspberry, I prefer strawberry. Okay, that's not how it works. The idea is to check if there's a, if there's a technical problem, having a corked wine, having a wine that is more like vinegary. Uh, those are more common problems. Well, that's what you're uh, asked to check. Okay, so here you just smell the wine. Now you might swell it a bit to really exhale all the aromas. No problem. Double check, huh? you taste. No problem. Okay, if you have a little doubt, you say, for instance, you ordered Italian wine. Huh? You never know if it's wine, if it's vinegar. No, I'm just kidding. This is a little joke because the, our Italian friend stole the, the World Cup from the French, so I'm a bit angry. But that's okay. I'll be finding out tons of good wines in Italy, but no emails and all that. No, no, no worries. Um, so, uh, so you have a little doubt in the quality of wine I was saying. Just do this, this little retrofaction action, uh, really twirl the, the, the wine in your mouth to really see if there's a problem. This technique is explained in a, in a specific video, so you can go look it up on this site. Just like this. Voila. Oh, you don't have to do this little thing. Um, be discreet, otherwise you look like a freak. And um, voila, the wine is good. Merci, monsieur. Et voila, you made it. See, it was not that that's hard. That hard. Um, all you have to do is now uh, drink your wine, have a good time with your friends, with your family, with your colleagues. Um, et voilà. I think all I have to do now is uh, drink to you. Have a lovely day, um, and I look forward to seeing you very shortly on winerendezvous.com. Allez, santé.